Hey guys, this is Wolf. Today I'm going to show you how to delay your breezy and your musty flicks. And if you don't know what I mean by delay, it's basically where you do a flip cancel in the middle of your back flip, and then you release the cancel right before the end of your back flip, and your car will basically snap upwards really quickly and you'll get a better scoop underneath the ball. The reason that you'd want to do this is that flip canceling will allow you to place your car exactly where you want it, right underneath the ball, and then as soon as you let go you're going to get a really quick scoop that will have way more power than doing a normal breezy flick will. Something I should warn you about is that as soon as you start learning this move, you won't be able to do a normal musty and a normal breezy anymore, like your brain will only want to do a delayed breezy, and so you're going to start missing those shots again for a while until you can hit this delayed shot with consistency. So if you don't know what I mean by flip cancel, it's the same thing that you do in a half flip, except you're going to be doing it in a musty and a breezy, and you're not going to be air rolling out of it, or else you're going to mess up the shot. So first I'm going to show you how to delay your musty, because it's going to be pretty difficult to do on the breezy if you're not already used to the thumb motion, and this will take quite a few hours of practicing before you can really get anywhere near doing it on a breezy. So first you should start without the ball, just so you can get used to the motion, and what you're going to do is you're going to jump up and lean your car back just like a normal musty, and then right as you do the back flip, you're going to push the left stick forwards, and hold it there for about 80% of the back flip as it slows your car down, and then right before the end of it, you're going to want to release the stick, and your car will flick its nose up really quickly. The thing that makes this move so difficult is that if you move the left stick a little too far to the left or too far to the right on its way up, it'll cause your car to air roll just like whenever you're doing a half flip, and that'll basically drive your flip straight into the ground. Also, when you're first learning this, you're probably going to bruise your thumb because you're trying to move the left stick so quickly when you try to do a flip cancel, so just note you don't really need to do it that quickly. You can do it kind of slow and you'll still be able to pull it off well. Don't end your gaming career just because you're trying to learn this move. So now we're finally at the breezy, and it's pretty much just the exact same thing you learned with the musty, except it's a lot easier to move the left stick to the left and right, and that's the most challenging part of this, is just getting used to not making that mistake. The best thing that you can do to delay your breezy consistently is just to remember not to rush it. Like, just as long as the left stick is going in a straight line forwards, you're going to hit it even if you do it pretty slowly. And sometimes when you do it slower, you end up getting a much more powerful flick from it. So that's it for the video guys, the rest of this is just up to how much you practice. If you're already used to doing breezy flicks, this may take you around 10 to 20 hours to learn this, and if you're not, it may take you around 30 to 40. It just comes down to how much time you're really willing to put into it. But I hope you all enjoyed and that you're able to learn a lot from this, and if you have any questions, just ask me in the comments below, and thanks for watching.